or away safely. I'm GM Lay for City News. Great advice. If you appreciate some beautiful photography, you'll be amazed at some of the work of my next guest. You can check out his website after the show, but he captures our city in a unique manner, posting a brand new picture every single day. And we welcome now Sam Javinru to homepage. Sam, great to have you with us. Thank you, David. Thank you for having me. And uh, we're not going to put your web address up for a minute, minute or two because That's we don't okay. want people to dash off to it. <laughs> the pictures are that good. Thank Let's you. Let's just take a look at some of them because sure. you... Um, well, yeah, as you head is, into work, what is it before or after work, or when well, do you take the is, pictures? Well, this is actually shot in the weekend and early in the morning. What, what I do is I take one photo every day, so mm -hmm. that means that every every day, wherever I go, I have the camera on me. So now that's uh, in so downtown Toronto. This is Toronto, Toronto in BC place. BC place. Yeah, we, so I have some uh, large photos as well as some uh, smaller ones, and then beautiful. And um, there you go. Ah, There's a very <laughs> nice. The CP24 yep. truck. Exactly. I was going home one day and I saw the truck, so I had a lens on me. Just tried to take a few photos. It's pretty much every day I have to post one photo. Yeah. So it could be anything. It could be from, um, um, you know, at my workplace, or it could be when I'm walking down the street, or it could be from a trip. This is uh, the beaches again in yes. Toronto. These are pretty much all in Toronto because, uh, well, that's where I live here. and work. Yeah. And, uh, now, what do you do, Sam, when you're not... I'm a creative uh, director at Optics Digital Pictures, uh, which is a post-production company, and we do animation and special effects. So that's now, my full-time job. That's your full-time mm -hmm. job. This yeah. is your passion here, exactly. clearly. Um, exactly. Uh, and, um, many folks outside of Toronto might not be clear as to what this is, but yeah. it's an incredible and very unique angle, angle of a, a brand-new uh, landmark for the city. Yeah, and uh, so that's another photo. Then I have some photos of, you know, um, local, yeah. you, you walk around, and um, see, of course, I do actually ask for permission for mm -hmm. whoever uh, that I post the photos from. That was just a. That's again. A person uh, with their dog. Yeah, it was a flat a, iron building. Yeah. Now that's interesting because again. that's a, a unique angle that you're taking that picture at. Thank you. Yeah, that's this one was uh, actually this is a very heavy um, traffic kind of a um, part of the city. So I mm -hmm. waited quite a long time for the street to clear up so I can actually take this photo. And then, um, so here's another photo. This Ooh. is actually shot from my uh, apartment window. Yes. One night I didn't have a photo, so I put it on a tripod and I shot a long exposure so I get all the streaking lights. That's uh, actually um, Bay Street. And um, What I found mm -hmm. uh, in going through your site, and I'm just so glad that I stumbled across it uh, literally one day just uh, surfing around, is that you really have been able to capture uh, aspects you. of Toronto that I'm familiar with, and Thank yet you. I'm seeing it in a brand new way. Thank you, that's very flattering. Well, th the actual reason that I started this was actually I wanted to look at my, Toronto in a different way. Mm -hmm. I really wanted to look at Toronto in every possible angle and go find new places because um, I was a newcomer. Mm -hmm. So um, I thought the best way is to start this project. So I have one photo every day. So I found a really great places down in Toronto. and. So here's, for example, another. Ooh, this is a, actually a video because I shot this um, oh, from my wow. apartment window again. Uh, this is I shot 2,000 photos overnight and put them together wow. as a as a video again. So that's another one. And I'll Sam, let's give them the uh, the mm -hmm. web address now. D D O I. D D O I dot C A is the is the, the website, website to get address. You there. It stands for daily dose of imagery. So, daily dose of imagery. Yeah. Well, it's a recommended daily dose and, Thank and you highly very much. recommended. Thank you. We'll look forward to seeing you again. And, thank you. Uh, I look forward to as it as we get further into this. But thank you for uh, thank sharing you. your expertise and uh, thank you obvious for skills me. with us. Okay. Thank, thank you. you. We've been talking with Sam and Jamin yeah. Again, ddoi.ca is the website. We'll take this break. When we get back, though, Jim Sanderson will be here to answer your questions. we got great prizes to give away today. A copy of U-File for your taxes. Also, a copy of Microsoft Office OneNote software to organize all your notes. Also, a copy of the I'm in Touch software to let you stay in touch with your computer from anywhere in the world. And, of course, each of the three winners received.